So my question is, how should I pay on a flight where the airline asks for passengers to pay from their seats? But on my particular flight, the Qibla is directly behind me when I sit on my seat. Also, most of the flight attendants are non-Muslims, so they wouldn't give any importance to the Salah. And they, they would prohibit it. They would like prohibit it. They would prohibit me from standing and being in empty corners of the plane as they are like emergency exits. We've addressed this issue before, uh, Farooq, but we will repeat it again. Standing up to offer your fard prayer is one of the pillars of Salat. So if you're able and you sit down, your prayer is invalid. This is number one. So if I'm unable to stand up simply because the flight attendants are not allowing to, especially if you are in the economy class. There is no room for you to stand, most likely, because of the, the, the airplanes being tight and the ceiling is low. In this case, if there is no possibility for you to stand up, then you may sit down. Facing the Qibla is one of the conditions of Salat. And this condition is excused if you're unable, as in the case while flying and the Qibla is to your back. So I cannot face the Qibla. I cannot stand, let alone face the Qibla. In this case, this condition is compromised and Allah has given you the concession to pray elsewhere due to necessity. Now, if you're in a business class or a first class, there is enough room for you to pray where you are standing up and sometimes you can even prostrate uh, in some uh, uh, airlines. But at least you can stand up and uh, maybe you can face the Qibla, so you have to do this. Bowing is normal, prostrating is, might not be possible. You can sit down and bow uh, or, or lean forward as if you're prostrating to the best of your ability. And Allah Azza wa Jal knows best.